Hi Aquarius, welcome back to your monthly zodiac reading. This is an extension of the monthly romance reading, so you might want to go ahead and listen to that first and then go ahead and listen to your respective sign. The first card that you got showing for the month of October is the Ace of Cups. The Ace of Cups promises a new adventure that begins in your life this month, whether it's a new romantic experience, if you are in a relationship with someone, you may be becoming pregnant, you may be saying hello to someone new in your family, uh, per se a child, a child that is born. You may be getting engaged, getting married. If you're single, you're going to meet someone new. You may have a new idea for a new venture, a new creative venture. Uh, maybe it's artistic, mu musical, if you're an artist or a musician. So it'll, it'll be the beginning of something new that promises lots of enjoyment, lots of love. But mostly it represents a new person that steps into your life, someone new that comes along. The hangman is warning of you having to look at things from a different perspective in order for this new experience to happen in your life. Perhaps your walls around your heart are a little bit too high for a new person to reach you, or you were just too busy with life in order to allow romance into your life, because this is a romance reading, so we're going to focus on just that. This card represents sacrifice, sacrificing one thing for another, so perhaps sacrificing some of the work or the things that distract you during the week so that you do have more time to allow someone new to come into your life. If you are in a relationship, sacrificing some of the hard work that you do all the time in order to allow time for your significant other. You need to look at things from a different perspective in order for them to change, but you do need to change some things. That card does represent that. Otherwise, things can become stagnant, and if you're looking for love, things will not change unless you do look at things from a different perspective and see where it is that you can change a little bit. What you do on a daily basis, uh, where you go, do things out of the ordinary. Go out of your comfort zone in order to try to find a new expressive avenue so you can allow love to meet you halfway. Okay? You're getting as well the Five of Cups. The Five of Cups speaks of arguments, of difference of opinions, of three people, perhaps even um, dishonesty, uh, cheating that could have occurred in the past, things that have happened in your life in the past that these, these emotions you need to release in order to um, allow something new to come into your life because perhaps some of these energies that are still lingering from past relationships, past disappointments, regrets, because this card does re um, represent regret, regrets that we hang on to when truly we had to do the choices that we did or they would not have ever happened. It, these are all learning lessons that we go through <clears throat> so we have to sometimes learn our lessons the hard way. That's just how we learn. Uh, in order to f have love into your life or find love, first you have to lose it so that you know what you're missing, so that you know what it is that you want in your life. So it makes you refocus so that you can understand better who you are, what your boundaries are in a relationship, what you would allow and not allow into your life anymore. For some of you, if you just ended a relationship, there is still a possibility to get back with that person if that is what you want, if you're regretting the choice that you made. If it just happened not too long ago, there is still a chance that you can go back because there's still cups standing up. You still have an opportunity. If this happened to you many, many years ago, then you need to learn and release, release the energy because it's holding you back from finding a new love. If you are in a relationship now and quarrels are affecting you, you need to step back take a look at things from a different perspective, sacrifice some time or whatever it is that this argument or dispute is over, or you're going to lose your significant other. You need to focus more on your relationship. Bring in some fresh new love into your relationship, okay? Because you need to. 
Um, whispers of love is advising you to rest and relax. It is essential. We all have fundamental needs to take breaks. So, you're obviously working too hard, Aquarius. You need to take breaks. You need to relax. And you need to focus and think about what has happened in your past. What can you do in the future to change things? To bring some fresh new experiences into your life. Things that you will enjoy doing. Things that you'll love. Absolutely love. And that will open you up to someone new. For romantic experiences. Alright guys. If you would like a private reading with me. Please contact me via my email that's running below this video. Send me a link. Or I will talk to you again closer to uh, Halloween. Bye for now.